Like, psh, I don't see how they're not going to make the playoffs. At least to play in. But I can't remember what teams I played. Like, probably these bigger scores is obviously the games I played. Like, definitely played that one. Never lost the game, so those are the ones I simulated. But I'm not about to go back and look at every single game and be like, oh, okay. This was, I know we beat Orlando at one point because I know I made that video. So, yeah, see? So, you know how I do. I get dumb on the game. So, when you see the outlandish scores, that's the games I definitely played. <laughs> Hey man, so I'm gonna play one last game as Keno, at least here, for the regular season. So you got the matchup with Devin Booker, and then uh, we're gonna move on to the All Star break. And yeah, I wonder if Keno made the dunk contest. Let's go look. Let me see. Uh. He made the starting rotation. I think this pretty much means he made the starting rotation. He didn't make the dunk contest. But he did make the three-point contest. Damn, Kendall out here killing it. Boy, I don't even think a white guy got records that good. Man shooting 57% from the three. And he working for free. <laughs> that ain't Queens get the money. We got to go get you a, a contract, man. Uh, let's meet the starting lineup for the visiting Phoenix Suns. At power forward, Jay Crowder. At forward, Jay Crowder. Last minute decision. I switched up the defense of the Simons. So, yeah, Booker going to be guarding Keno, but I forgot Devin Booker brings the ball up. So, you know, that's going to make him go extremely dumb on the game. So, I put uh, Keno on Mikael Bridges. Melo's going to guard Devin. At 6 7, number 2. Grab my ball. At four. At six eight. Number seven. Look who coming off look the bitch last, Kenno. You done played your way all the way to being the star of the team. You the face of the squad. At God. At six six. Number one. Look, they ain't even gotta say your name. Mother just knows it's number one. Sports, get ready for some NBA action. Brian Anderson with you. Hall of Famers Doris Burke and Grant Hill joining us tonight, along with the fourth member of our team, Allie LaForce. Hey, Allie. Thanks a lot, BA. A long wait in the valley for winning basketball. It's back. Good stuff, Allie. Now a moment to take a look at the year-to-year -year scoring output and how it's been trending for DeAndre Ayton. And when you look at his offensive output over the past few years, it seems like other teams have figured him out and have his number now. He's having That's because to I had to play and simulate minutes the down. End, but without producing nearly the same results. So let's take a look at the Phoenix Suns starting lineup. Bridges and Crowder holding down the forward spots. Paul and Booker, the talented backcourt. So most of the scores stay around the 100 the mark. And for the Knicks, Instead of being like 138 to 125. It's ABC I just ain't the got there spot, yet. Manning the middle. And Grant, how often do players check in on their own stats during a season? B.A., 
Everybody in the league watches their numbers. Some guys are just willing to admit it. And so off the ball, tip, it is New York. Come on, Devin. Can you keep up with Keno? Here's Marbury. Pass to Iverson from deep three-point range. That shot is off. I held it too long. Booker with the defensive effort. Now here's Aiden. Because I wasn't sure if Mikael Bridges was going to actually go try to put some D on him. So I held the ball a little bit longer. But I also had to call for the pass, which I shouldn't have had to. Because coming off the screen should shoot. automatically have been a pass there. Puts it up. That one no good. New we York missed two. the other way with it. They went to Phoenix for their last meeting with the Suns. Came out with a victory. Aiden, you don't want this. Aiden, you don't want this. Never easy to do. But they pulled it off and played a great game. And I think it was clear that their plan was to attack from the three-point line. And it worked to perfection. And Phoenix has possession. Following the bucket by the Knicks. Don't dribble, son. And about a minute gone in the first. That's all reason why I took him off Devin Crowder Booker. From the arc, nails it from beyond the arc. We know this. Jay Crowder is an effective shooter. Someone who can shoot the three well. You've got to get into his space. To the inside. Damn. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. I hate that they throw it so slow on the game, man. Now here's Bridges. Oh, so I'm gonna be guard Bridges. My bad. Adding insult Fast to injury break. with Picked the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. Uh, let's see if that serves as a momentum builder. What a great sequence for this group. What? Iverson can't hit. Listen, Is it cold? He knows he should have made that shot. We'll see if they can work it back to the game by pissing me off. They swipe it. There you go, Marbury. Out of bounds. What the Phoenix's ball? Phoenix. And as hey, bro. Halfway through the season, let's see how the power rankings are shaking out. You take a look at Utah. They slipped a bit. Still in the top ten, though. Seeing where the Knicks are, they've surprised so many people with their ability to maintain this astonishing display of dominance. But here they are, the best team in the league late into the season. What are we doing, man? Come on, 2K. For Phoenix, they've gone two of three to get this one going to the middle. Back to Aiden. And okay, Aiden bro. The stuff. Like textbook, well, bro. That's the they, everything does. Mr. Devin Booker. This guy increasingly becoming such a good passer. To the paint. Here's Iverson, and he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. There is an imagination, a creativity. This guy's passing drives the offense. And the first quarter of action, two minutes in. Oh my God, Melo! Oh, there you go, Melo! The oh my God! <laughs> Let's take another look at the staunch defense. Oh, gee, Patrick! One block. I mean, letting them know up front. Well, you got three shots blocked in a row. And eager to knock away shots. I love it. That's championship defense right there. Here's Paul. 14 points for him last game against Minnesota. And what a wrecking ball defensively. Seen by the four steals he had in that game. And to the outside. Bridges on the double. I'll take it. Pass to Marbury. Knocks down the long J. But Carmelo Anthony is capable when he wants to of spotting that open man. Pretty pass. Paul passes to Crowder. Come on, Grandma Ma. And Crowder with the jam. With two hands on the rock, he powers it through. Totally in control, protecting the ball the whole way. Well, you think about Jake Crowder's career. He has bounced around to a few teams. The hips. But one thing we know, he's always had an impact to affect the Fuck out of here, son! Defense. We're all playing over here, son! And that's out of bounds. Phoenix will retain possession.
And here in the first, about three minutes in. Plenty of daylight on that shot. Paul's gotten his second bucket of the game. And Doris Crowder's defense, a big part of what he can offer a team. Right, because he's strong enough to guard in the post. And he's one hope. enough to guard on the perimeter. Think about it. 2020 NBA Finals, he was asked to contain LeBron James. That's the kind of confidence coaches have in Crowder's competitive spirit defensively. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Phoenix. One shot. Range jump shot has been a good weapon for them up to this point, guys. Yeah, and I think the other thing that's helped them early tonight are the points they've gotten off turnovers. And clean. The Suns leading. Larry, watch out, bro. Booker with it. A 20-point game for him in the win against Minnesota. Over Anthony. And there's Aiden on the assist by Booker. Well, that's a determined scorer right there. DeAndre Aiden is showing a little toughness on the interior finish. Pass to Iverson. Hey, hangs it midair and converts the double punch layup. He's uh, what the rest of the team Boy, everything's you love what this guy is doing right now. He's taking smart shots, shooting a high percentage, starting to cook. Booker, good. Booker. To me, the defense did all it could in that instance. It's just amazing how Devin Booker made I'm moving up slow because I want everybody else to get into the play, over. but ain't nobody else. Here's there we go. Finally. Damn, look at his numbers, averaging about 11 a game. B.A., the one-hand dunk just looks so fluid. Yeah, absolutely. Even smooth when he's powering it home like that. Hands. Now here's Crowder. Oh, and Johnson with a block. And they're able to recover. Count it. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Half to the outside. Mellow a shot. Go on, Mellow. Pass to Iverson. Beyond the arc. And they recover it. The three is up. And that one goes. I don't know why they play with kiddo threes right now. Bucket and eight tries. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. They're on the home court, bro. What's going on? Outside Booker. Again, the sun's good for two. That's his second make in seven attempts. Not a pretty start. Here's Iverson. Booker defending. Pass to Johnson. Come on, Grandma. Here's Marbury. Okay. And down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. Woo! When you finish like that, you deserve to brag. <laughs> Impressive. No question. How about that from your point guard, gentlemen? Playing big at the rim. Okay. Here's Paul. After the basket by New York. Second Come shot. Come on, Larry. Larry. With the lay -in. Crowder's got seven points in the game. The Knicks have gone a fantastic 8 of 11 so far. Inside. Great teamwork and great timing. Oh, spectacular play. Phoenix. Phoenix calls timeout. They want to keep rolling here following a win against Minnesota. Yeah, and what was really impressive Devin was they stayed no patient. The shot selection was excellent, and you see the result. Well, typically, Greg, great decision-making leads to great shooting percentages. I thought that team played a very smart game. The Suns uh, making a switch Devin. here. Johnson's checked in. Outside Booker. Pass to Johnson. Now Aiden. Oh, man. I already know what the computer did right there. It does that to me. No doubt on the dunk. Here's Iverson. Booker defending. The shot. What? Misses Bro. And for him, that's a great look. Expect him to go right back to it if it's available. Fuck out of here, no bitch. Doubt. Very good play call. Good execution. Sometimes it just doesn't fall. Pass to Anthony. Here's Iverson. Two minutes. Takes the three. And again, New York with the triple. Man, right, man. Defensively, now you've got to find a way to slow this guy down because he's putting it to you. Up top, Paul. Checking the numbers. He's averaging Bro, was that to a double dribble? New York has gone three for five from deep so far in this matchup. Down low. Here's Anthony. And Play a man on the view, baby. Oh, that, that could have 
could easily have been a three-point play. A little contact, Mello still goes right to it. Ball finds Booker. Okay, what was that animation, bro? Aiden with it. And here's Paul. Banked it in off the glass. He has six. <laughs> this night already has the makings of an offensive war. Well, the fans love it. Coaches may not like the lack of defense, but boy, the rules promote scoring, no doubt. Here's Marbury. Pass to Johnson. Here's Iverson. Why didn't they take him to the three, nice bro? Off the left rim and they play him, man. 19 points in the game. You can see it. Once this guy gets his rhythm, he is so hard to slow down. What an excellent night for him and his team. Now here's Crowder. He's got seven. There's 48 seconds left in the first. And the ball's out of bounds. It was last touched by Anthony. He keeps them blocks in the field. All the blocks going out. Seven of them three times. Devin good book got blocked. <laughs> Here's Booker, and you look at his numbers, just over 21 Try a game. Again. And it's out of bounds. Still Phoenix's ball. <laughs> so it's Phoenix now. They trail by one. Four on the clock. Long ah, Johnson soon. Damn it. Boy, with his shot not falling right now, it might be time to look in a different direction. See if you can get your teammates started. Oh, wait, oh. You don't mess me Here's up. Here's Iverson. Booker defending. Oh, and that one, no question. Howard you and Kane to the middle of the play, right? Without about to drive here. Juice on that tomahawk, fellas. No one is going to stop that. Man, when he's coming in with that level of force, that's just too much right there. And it's the same. Oh, my God. Now, well, two ball for one. I'm about to call yeah, two for one. You never get a two for one because well, Chris Paul. You just let Chris Paul right like through. He can get his jumper going. He's going to it. There's such confidence in that shot. Right wing. Shots good by Marbury. And See if we can get three for two. Three. <laughs> against good defense, he finds just enough room to operate. Oh, my God. And connects on the ninth footer. Which way the ball going? Paul's got ten points in the game. Boy, I love Chris Paul's ability to work on the interior. Tenacious, crafty. Few oh, it goes! <laughs> 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 in the nick of time. The basket. Oh, what a miraculous shot! He's gonna remember that one. Listen, under duress of the end of the period, you just throw it up and hope. Well, we've seen some great shots in the first quarter. No and see, that's what I'm saying, though. See how he was standing still right there? So far behind the three-point line. You know what? Net far. But he, I, they let me hit that one. But anytime you run off the screen, they'll push you back further than what you actually are trying to control your curve to be right at the three-point line. They'll make your curve to go further back from the three-point line, and then how you miss that one. And he's always been a coach on the floor. Chris Paul is a communicator. With anything, uh, whether it's business, work, relationships, whatever. CP3 never shot. Look at Chris Paul, but I'm tired of damn interviews. Always holding himself and his teammates accountable. If you're just joining us, we've oh. played through one quarter in this one. All right, before we move on, what do you guys think about what we've seen from the Knicks? Well, their offense is clicking so far, capturing the momentum here early on. Boy, it's been a really pretty Driven. thing to watch, executing their game plan to perfection. We've got Carmelo Anthony, also Johnson out there, and it's ABC in at the five spot. So that's who's on the floor for the Knicks. There's the triple. And the Knicks, another three. And he's coming, he's coming a along. Huge performance and his confidence couldn't be any higher and his coach knows that too well the best players to me deliver night after night after night so as long as he's oh they fro you bitches give me the ball bro that'll do it wow an emphatic two-handed slam the next with the lead going right into the punk ass and he drives in lays it up they gave me that weak ass animation bro come on stop 
That's 29 for him. And for players these days, a lack of shooting can be a big hindrance. Get up, Paul. Grant, would you be more concerned by struggles from the perimeter or the free throw line? I'd be more concerned with struggles at the free throw line. I mean, if you struggle there, you can become very, very tentative out there on the court. Hold on, man. Nah, there ain't no foul. Well, okay, because they want to come out the court. That was out on, bro. 157 left to play in the second quarter. They should have gave me the damn uh, illegal screen off that one. Let's it fly. And he drains the quick shot. And the Knicks lead by 14. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is you going, Mikhail? players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment to play the right way. Look out about the help on defense. Outside Paul. Shoots over Hampton. The putback. Controls the rebound and the putback. Really, I want to see them crash the offensive glass a little harder here. They were so good at that in the first quarter. Pass to Anthony. Uh, to that was supposed to be coming from him. And anticipation to stop it. Here's Bridges. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Oh, it's about to be coming from R.J. Hampton, bro. In the quarter. Well, quick transition. I, I call for the lob where R.J. Hampton still had the ball. A nice finish on the transition opportunity. Here's Iverson. He's covered by Holiday. And again, New York with the triple. But you love that they they had a little dude up on me, man. Time and time again. You Damn, you would have thought I missed a whole lot more shots than this. 55 seconds left in the half. to Paul shoots over Hampton that's good from Paul on the assist by Holiday Paul's got 16 well as good as Chris Super Paul's one. passing game is the scoring ability is on par pass to Houston to the paint here's Anthony Mello over Crowder and it's New York with another oh, the man turn it off the game bro all the damn extra movement getting a number of looks from point blank range four seconds separating the shot and game clocks here's a three from Paul knocks down the triple Paul's got 19 and when you're trailing in a game it, it can be tempting to try to go for the big play who wants to get Here's the ball? Iverson. Allen Hughes, you want it? You want the last shot? Him, last game against the Magic in Orlando. Boy, and defensively, he had them off balance. He was able to come away with four steals. Three seconds left. And he <laughs> <up strong>. <laughs> <laughs> he drew that double team. Hit Woo. Oakland. Defensively, you can't afford to let him get to the rim that easy. Sorry, RJ. That might be why their deficit is what it is right now. I tell you, you can't get stops if you're unwilling to. I almost called a timeout and brought you and in. So but it's the New York Knicks going into the break up 12. Coach should have called about it. the way they've attacked the paint. This throwback approach is paying off. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Thanks so much. I'm here with Coach Tom Thibodeau. And Tom, what's it going to take down the stretch to win this ball game? Wait a second. Why was Oakley playing? Allie. After the break, Oakley. we'll see a right Oakley back just play here center, to begin quarter number three. Because I thought I hit. Did not just hit R2 twice? And now, I ain't hit R2 trying. Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure it is to bring you into the 2K studios again. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. For the Knicks, the first quarter was pretty even. They trailed by as many as six points in the first period. Just a great first half from them, especially the second quarter. They're up 12. Hey, big fella, what's your take on New York so far? Ball movement was a real factor for them. They played them selfishly with patience. Guys got shots in their favorite spots. When you get those high-percentage looks, it's going to happen. And, Kenny, what are your thoughts on Phoenix? They really got to turn the intensity up in the second half. You look at their free throw differential, it's a big gap. They need to be more physical and start earning more fouls. We're getting those assists, man. And that'll about do it as we get ready for the second half. Let's take it down to Kevin Harlan. Shout out to my main man, Joel. Joel, Joel what up? I forgot to sleep with uh, a blanket over my feet, man. The second half of so I'm all congested this morning. If this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be.
What are y'all doing with Keno? On the court right now for the Suns. Paul and Booker, the talented backcourt. Crowder and Aiden, the bigs. And it's Bridges in at the three. Court vision, intellect, basketball IQ, the masterful distributor that is Chris Paul. Here's Marbury. Back to Anthony. Shoots over Bridges. Another one falls for New York. <laughs> they are Let's see if Kiddo don't score another point, how well can we win this game? The sun shooting has been good. I can play defense and just win the game. Now here's Paul. He's covered closely. He gets Good it in ball. there. Paul's got 21 points in the game. They just look so overwhelmed inside. Yeah, that's why they continue to get attacked. Here's Marbury. He's guarded by Paul. Yeah, I'll just stand around Left and shit. side Johnson. Up and over Crowder. Turn around Jay. And yes, it goes. Got a little English on that one. Johnson's I hate they it. have him hold the ball so long. So hard to check. He can turn you one way and use the spin move to make you look sad. Outside Paul. Again, the Suns good for two. I'll tell you, individually, he is doing all he can. But right now, somebody's got to step in and support this guy. There is an absolute certainty that when Chris Paul stops playing basketball, he will be in Springfield in the Hall of Fame. Wherever he's been able to play, he has been able to drive. Six to shoot. Anthony against Bridges. Anthony with a bucket. Wow, what a start to this half. Three for three, dictating the pace on the offensive end. They're rolling early. And with Paul, after some injuries early, he changed how he went about his offense. Well, you think about him coming out of college, he was very solid athletically. Still good in that department, obviously. But the Come on, bro. majority of his success comes yeah, about from to one piss of the me off, bro. Could they move me behind him, man? Game that we've ever seen. Iverson. Why are you standing out here, man? Three, I really don't want no picks, bro. I don't need picks. He takes it in. Oh, a two-handed power slam. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Just under two and a half minutes into this third quarter now. I could break a dude down. I don't need that pick. Puts it up from the Marbury. high post. And it's Phoenix with another. Well, the mid-range is always a good option for Chris Paul. Pass to Anthony. No good off the back of the rim. And that's their first miss after hitting four in a row to start the half. Grandma Ma, I'm and I just you win. making the effort plays that everyone around him appreciates. It is certainly making an impact. I need tonight. a timeout. No doubt on the scoreboard, in the body language of the players, you can tell which team is in complete command. And how about the mobile one block we just saw? Amazing defensive work. <laughs> Showing no signs of giving up this lead. That block sent shockwaves into the opposition. We're moving my character, bro. I'm not pressing for him to move. We're moving my damn character, Outside bro. Paul. All right, timeout. Oh, and Johnson with a block. Tipped away. Damn it. Crowder, the pass to Paul. Nah, bitch. You know, you my guy, Chris Paul. Here's Iverson. You know, they barely needed other contributions. This lead has been built through his offense. Now he was able so to block the pass. It's a 14 point game. But they don't let you get the steals when you're coming off the screen and you're trying to put your hand up there to Outside get the steal. Ball. Not like you used to be able to do. We've gone about three and a half minutes here into the third. Oh. Listen, oh. simply put, he's got to finish that. It's not like the defender was right on top of him. Just disrespectful. <laughs> if the defense is <laughs> the move, he will take it. Let's just say they were a little slow to react there. See, okay. See, I was, I was saying I was going to play calm, man. Y'all making me mad. Here, get a bucket so we can call timeout. Lays it up and banks it in. 
Paul's got 27 John points. John Stark coming in. Man, Chris Paul's ability with traffic, with bodies around him to keep his focus and score it, that is special. Yeah. Now a timeout called by New York. Phoenix making some changes. McGee, he's checked in for DeAndre Ayton. Sharich comes in for Crowder. And it's Johnson in for Bridges. Here's Marbury. He's guarded by Paul. Here's Iverson. Hits the trifecta. 43 points in the game. This guy has been unstoppable. It has not mattered at all what the defense throws at him. He's had an answer. Watch out for Javel. Here's Booker. That one doesn't drop. New York goes the other way with it. Lost him. <laughs> Put it back on you, son. And did a shum god on you. The finishing transition, nice and easy. The Suns have gone six for nine in the half. Now Paul, 27 points for him. Off the mark there with a three. He made a three back in the first half, but that's it. We'll see if he can find. Ah, oh, boy, I'm gonna go for a lot. And they're running. Jumps up. Damn, I tried, kiddo. <laughs> I was way behind on that one. I tried, kiddo. <laughs> Boy, does he have a way to get his teammates involved? To the middle. How'd they pull that off, PA? Right? And I'm not sure. A tremendous play. For Phoenix, they've gotten seven of their first 11 attempts to go in this half. I don't think I got chase down artists on you either, though. Ball into the lane. Okay. The hell? And the hell was that? That one's good. On the assist from Paul. Paul's got five assists tonight. Pass to Iverson. To the inside. Ooh, Marbury is always getting in the damn way. Soft touch off the glass. He's got six. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly, and capitalizing. And he's able to get it back. He blocks it again. Here's Iverson, covered by Johnson. Here starts. Starks, if you don't put the damn ball up, bro. Phoenix Yo ass. grabs the miss. Well, you gotta miss sometimes, but that one seemed like a gimme. Two minutes. Pass to Johnson. The three ball. That one's good. Give I know that's gonna be my man. I would hope it starts to go switch got over. His third assist of the night. They need to run plays for him. Damn it. Get I do not who I'll pass the ball. Whatever it takes to get him producing. Here's Starks. Inside. Ewing. And he comes up with a bucket. And the Knicks lead by 18. They have no answer defensively inside. Larry. What's the computer ball. doing, bro? Checking the numbers. He's averaging close to 15 a game. It can be tough to find space in the mid-range area. Probably should have passed that one up. And it's in there. And he's just that was too close to be in the damn block. Like Why did they he's make him do that? Continuing to pile it on. You want to make sure your opponent knows they have absolutely zero chance of a comeback. And nice finish by him. Paul passes to Charge. Outside Booker. And he drains it, making him 7 for 15 for the day. Well, you love the lethal scoring ability off the dribble. Booker putting extraordinary pressure on the defense. Iverson can't hit. No. Phoenix oh has gone 1 for 2 from outside the arc in this third quarter. Outside Paul. Pass to him. I'm trying to get him to space. Charge. There you go. Back to Paul. Gonna pass out from 18 feet oh, away. Shit. Again, gonna pass out. Good for two. Well, this quarter has been all about this guy. He is trying to. Why can't I call a timeout, man? This game's stupid. Nick shooting bro. the ball 70 percent in this game. New York. Now a timeout called by New York. Boy, one thing you love about Dario. Maybe Charles, they're giving Cam Johnson credit for having defensive skills. Big man. This guy has great vision. Yeah, that should have been a three, bro. He on fire, man. How's that not three? Haynes checked in for the Suns. Bro, I didn't pass Here's the ball. Ewing. I just held down the key. Just to see. Down. 
I was trying to hold my protect the ball. I need to make a pass. Just never gets old watching him we'll take it. like that. Five what assists. a unique talent he is. Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. That's only because okay. the computer won't even get the ball back since it like to get the ball back to the inbound. McGee in the post. Yes, and it's Booker with the setup. Booker's got four assists in the game. Not putting his head down. He continues to produce with the team trailing. Too slow, son. Here's Iverson driving inside. And the dunk to finish. Hey, he pointed. <laughs> his arrow's been trending up as of late. And he's been magnificent tonight. Oh, I said I'll go make Ken on the top Booker. five scores. And the Suns get another three. Oh, no, 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 no. Let me get up here. Versatile offensive skill set. Devin Booker is a threat once he steps across the half court line. It could go. Oh, and he hits it. See what I'm saying, bro? That is a huge three pointer. Extends the lead. It is like dramatic. Possible second that'll give him a big boost going into the fourth period. And so it's the New York Knicks feeling confident. 18 point lead to win that quarter. Their efficiency has been off the charts. They're running their sets well with patience and purpose. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. I was going to make it on the top five in scoring. I forgot about that. So I was supposed to go over 100 five times. So we can knock Will Chamberlain out. The rankings. Damn it. And we take a listen in now to Tom Thibodeau on a recent huddle. Right back, man. Let's go score, stop, score here. Everyone talk defensively. Well, there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth I'm quarter, ball. but stranger things have happened. They've got Johnson. I got the ABC in at you. the center position. That's the five for New York right now. Here's Marbury. Sweet little floater. I can't do that against Chris Paul. Do it against Cameron Payne. Can't do it against Chris Paul though. Shooting a fantastic 57 percent. That little should be seven in for Keno. Left side Booker. Another one falls for Phoenix. There are few people in the league that are more scary when they start to find their rhythm than Devin Booker, and he's cooking right now. Pass to Iverson. Wasn't even trying to score, bro. I was just moving because John Starks came over here. What else is there? This guy's accuracy this quarter has been phenomenal. Here's Booker. Will not go. Misses off the front iron. New York shooting the ball incredibly well tonight. 73% from the floor. Shots good by Iverson. Okay, I, I'm sorry. Asshole move kicked Everyone in. I, I wasn't really. Y'all <laughs> <laughs> <Inexcusable. laughs> yeah, know I really want to go to the basket and get a dunk. Boy, we about 30 on y'all, man. Don't nobody care about the little duck, bro. How about you stop Kiddo? Why Kiddo got like 35 points on you, bro? To the middle. Damn it. That's the damn slow ass. Trap his ass. Now here's Johnson. Defense right on him. Final quarter of play. About a minute and a half off the clock. Shot clock at six. Has to pay. Damn it. To the left side wing. Ah oh, man, it's computer Johnson man. Gets it to go on the assist All I did was just press the steal button. I ain't pressed no direction, bro. You simply must play better defense than that. This guy is too good from distance. Come on, you want me to break it down, son? Here's Iverson. Hits yet again. Wow. I'm trying to get one of the teammates the ball, man. Oh, make that 61 but. points. Everything is going his way right now. Time called here. The Suns decide to talk it over. Anthony checked in for New York. DeAndre Ayton, he's checked in for the Suns. Bridges comes in for Sharage. Phoenix has got six out of okay, 15 I'll threes so far in this game. Two. Outside Johnson. We're about two minutes into the fourth here. Come on, man. Y'all let that little slow ass man. That dude is uh, Kyle Anderson, man. Good job attacking. Those restricted area shots are what every NBA player is looking for. Same player. Here's Larry. So Larry can pass it to Kenno for Kenno for three. 
Pass to Johnson. Here's Iverson. Booker descending. No good on the yeah, three. Yeah, took too long on the play, bro. Phoenix, I told y'all do that five five seconds before y'all did it. So far on the fourth. Here's Payne. And rejected. And now the Knicks on the break. <laughs> That's the type of move that you see in a dunk contest. Takes great confidence to alley oop. To I don't know how Kiddo ain't in the dunk contest, yeah. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. All these self lobs. Kiddo, I guess, is like dunk contest of our bear. Takes a three. And the Suns get another three. After hitting nothing from downtown in the first half, that's his second make sense. Here's Marbury, defended by Payne. Pass to Anthony, right side Johnson. Here's Iverson, out to the right wing, just five to shoot. Here's Anthony, and give him another one. He's six of eight and looking solid. Yeah, their defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets at the rim. Starting to wear down. Top pain. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We played about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter here. It's fun for us to sit back and watch him go to work, but that's our job, not the defense. I don't they like the way y'all stand. On that play. Timeout called the Knicks. Adjustments are a part of every game and every quarter of a game. I think coach sees something here. Well, this is a chess match. Looking ahead a few moves. Because Cameron Payne scores at the basket. Chris Paul, he's checked in for Payne. Here's Marbury. To the inside. Okay, there you go. I was about Johnson. to say, I passed the ball. I ain't going to pass the ball. Perfectly placed pass. And the Knicks lead by 19. Outside Booker. It's good. Devin Booker. Uh, inside against good defense. Booker with a nice adjustment. Takes care of business. Here's Marbury. He's guarded by Paul. Pass to Ewing. Out to the right wing. Down low. His match. Here's Johnson. Larry, just put it up. Run and down. he converts the layup. Johnson's got four points now in the quarter. Man, that's now ten straight points in the paint. I'm Wait, why sure is Larry going Devin Booker? Oh, good Cam Johnson on the damn court. Stupid ass. Booker against Johnson. Booker on the take. And the shot's good. So Booker's got 30 points. Well, they're not behind because of this guy. He is putting on a tremendous run. Shot's good by Iverson. Piss me off. Well, they're that. calling his number time and time. Obviously, again. Larry should be guarding Cam delivery. Johnson, and the Cubs recognize that. Outside Paul. Another one falls for Phoenix. He's shooting the lights out down the stretch, trying to keep them competitive. New York has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. And again for three. Buries his tenth triple of the game. Unbelievable, B.A. Unbelievable. From 11 feet away, got a hand on it. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. Now that's how you block the rim. Give them the two points and add a little style there as well. Ridiculous. I tend on the dunk contest. Phoenix has got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. Timeout called the Suns. Oh, damn, it's on three minutes. No doubt. Coach Just wants my to improve time their interior defense. I think right now they're giving up way too many easy looks. That is a recipe for disaster. Monty Williams, Notre Dame. And now let's take a look at the New Balance player of the game. This has been one of the most dominant performances I've ever seen. What's incredible is he has no off switch, but just a tremendous motor. And he's making an impact on every single possession. And look at him. He think it's just another game. He is totally in control of his emotions. And you know, this home arena really appreciates this guy. And it's clear that he takes pride in playing his best in front of them. New York on D. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 15 points. 
Well, Chris Paul is usually the guy to deliver the pass. Well, well, he was about like 20 at some point. Catch and shoot game. Go ahead, Chris. Let your teammates make it easy on him. Connects again from distance. Oh, Ooh, you can tell he's feeling it right now. The BA, he's on fire. And the Suns shooting about 60% for the game. Y'all boy know I care more about defense than offense. And it's good for two. That's cool. Computer does that to me all the time. 16 in the second half. Well, the problem is they haven't gotten production from any other spot. But right now, this guy is good. Shots good by Iverson. Coming down the stretch, they've leaned on the perimeter game. Boy, the three-point arc has been a major factor in what they've done here tonight. You love the aggressiveness. Larry, you got to come over. Larry. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key to in the on any one individual. <laughs> Three-pointer. The rebound by Bridges. I expect to make him turn that way. So it's Phoenix now. Mello. Uses the glass on the layup. Such a smart offensive player. Mikel Bridges assertive and focused when he gets this close. Well, the scoreboard tells you everything you need to know about this one. A great showing here for the Knicks. Pretty clear who the better team was today. They dominated in just about every phase of this game, Grant. <laughs> B.A., it's almost hard to think what didn't go well for them. Their plan, their execution, everything was absolutely on point. After coming away with this W, this will give them 42 wins on the year. Only a two-game series, and they win both. They have to be satisfied with this. Yeah, Booker, good. You know, I think this guy just loves the game of basketball. The preparation, the interaction with his teammates. He has fun. Why they make him step back? Iverson. Damn it. Phoenix has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Here's Paul. And it's Ewing with a rebound. They have really been in control of this one. You don't want to get complacent here. Here's Iverson. They didn't put crowd on him. That's the three <laughs> they didn't put crowd on kid on that. Got a comfortable lead, and the fans are loving it. Well, they're getting ready to celebrate, no doubt. They know it's theirs to lose at this point. Paul passes to Bridges. And so they choose to intentionally foul. And the Suns going with a whole new group out there. First team could have called a timeout. Some substitution. His shot was hindered by that momentous. I know they ain't even getting on the game. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that. Man, only about the game, bro. And they keep attacking on the offensive end. Now here's Peyton Landry Schmidt. Drives to the hoop. Takes it up with Alfred both hands and rips it down. See, the unpredictability of Alfred Payton helps him in these situations. Good at taking what the defense gives him in that instance. Parries it from three. Stepping up and nailing an important I was not planning to get 86 points. Away. Yeah, playing with great energy and great effort. And as a coach, you'd love to see this from your team every single night. And the Thinking basketball the game, holiday. Well, they needed this run way earlier. At some point, it's too little, too late. Yeah, but then again, this run came against a team that may have felt it had already won, and you get the sense it let its guard down. Oh, damn. How about they put RJ in? But RJ already in here. They're up by 26. We've got 13 seconds left. Of and so it's the Knicks taking care of business in this one. They didn't have too many problems tonight. They didn't. Just a tremendous team effort. Once they had that big lead, they were not going to let the visitors back into the game. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Allie LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching tonight's game. We'll see you next time. Oh, I think the self live. Did not do it like a self live or something. Nah, nah, nah. It was the one pass Chris Paul blocked. Hey, you one got the double double.